As spring starts rolling in, I want to get to cutting my grass and doing some yard work around the house. I don't, I don't remember the last time I've done yard work around the house. If I'm being honest with you, I really don't. Uh, I have to like trim some of the bushes in the back and uh, get my flower beds going. Um, I don't, it's not going to snow anymore, but the rain is honestly going to make things a lot worse. And then obviously the weather is still not perfect so we're just waiting for that time to come landscaping stuff is still pretty expensive so all right i think morning brief starts any minute now so hopefully i'm not too late uh, i think i just made it in time yeah everyone's in here and i'm not sorry guys i don't think i'm late but yeah you guys are already in here before me i was just cutting my lawn early in the morning doing a great deed i guess you can call it all right, we're going to see what we got today from... Who is this? Is this... Okay, so this is a detective. Um, the detective's got the front today. Usually, that's a rare occurrence, so they must have stuff for us. Morning, John. Morning, guys. I hope you all having a good day so far. I still need my coffee. My eyes feel like they're just going to close shut and just remain there. All right, so the county has kindly gifted us a new cyber truck. Ooh, that's nice. We got a new Cybertruck. I remember the first time we got our new electric vehicle. The first time. It, that was insane. A Cybertruck? For a patrol vehicle. That's the same thing I'm kind of wondering right now. That would kind of be weird. Today we're going to be using it as a bait car. Because the reckless driving and red light violations has increased. Due to recent car thefts and vehicle parts being stolen. We decided to use that as a bait. Yeah, his words got kind of twisted up. Okay. So it's kind of like the thing where we use the Bugatti. I remember a few years back, we used the Bugatti. Um, we had the Bugatti rented for like 10 days, and then the criminal crashed it. And uh, we had to pay the fees back to the owner. And that was pretty sad. Uh, LCSO let things get way too far out of hand that day. All right, everyone, let's keep our eyes peeled. Yep, we got it. We'll use this car as a bait to locate any thieves in our area. Okay. The detective will be hidden near the vehicle. The patrol officers will be scouting the area and mostly focusing on traffic violations. Okay. Detectives will be out and about and then patrol deputies will be just doing their normal jobs. Alright, got it. Alright, I gotta rip this paper off. I got enough notes on this one. I'm just gonna like stick it to my windshield or something. Hopefully I'm getting a new car soon. Uh, I do originally ride a truck, but that's being fixed currently. And they decided to leave me off a loner, which is the Crown Vic. Did they change the speed limits? I swear you were not allowed to go 45 in a residential area. They must have changed this. 45 is actually kind of crazy. It's actually pretty fast. Uh, I might stop at the gas station in a few and actually go get some coffee because I am very, very tired. I can't even keep my eyes focused on the road. It's almost 8 a.m., um, but I don't have a great sleeping schedule, of course, so it's not like... It's really not like I sleep good anyway. I mean, sometimes I go to sleep at 2, sometimes I go to sleep at 10, so... Um, in this case, last night I went to sleep at, like, 12 and woke up at 6 to do my lawn, um, spent an hour doing that, so... I mean... Dispatch, we have a black van pulling up to the truck. Okay, I guess I guess it has started. Probably going to head up to the gas station. Um, I heard that the Cybertruck is actually at the... Um, it's actually at the parking garage. So we're going to head over to the gas station that's uh, next to the farms. I don't want to disturb anything. Uh, they also told us to majorly keep out of Springfield so that the detectives can work. Um, obviously if any crimes are committed, we'll know, but three males in black clothing approaching the vehicle. Yeah, the, we were, we're just told to like, obviously keep our eyes out and just uh, see if anything is going to happen. We don't know what's going to happen right now. Apparently there's three armed, not armed, but three males in black clothing approaching. So the bait car is already having su success. So that's pretty good. One Alpha 11, show me on a 1080 with a gray Cybertruck. 
currently heading down Cedar Street. We'll keep you updated. I don't know entirely what happened, but we just stopped. We just like stopped getting radio feed right now. We get 1020s of the 1080. I hope they didn't lose him. Um, I've been just sitting around here. I mean, the Cybertruck hasn't came by here any. Okay, Highway 55 South near the Sheriff's Office. Oh, there he goes. He's on Riverside. 100% he's on Riverside. I have all the location. He's starting on the Colonial Drive. Okay, I think I can catch him off if he keeps going straight. Um, yeah, I think I can actually catch him off here. He should be coming down this side right here. Let me get ready. Yep, there he goes. All right, we need some spike strips. I shouldn't be lead unit, but the only person we have behind me is a truck. So I guess I'll take lead unit. I don't know how fast these things are, but he's like zooming down the highway. I need to wait for him to crash or something. Something major. Yeah, hopefully uh, one of the LCSO units can give us a um, spike unit. All right, I've been also cleared to pit him. So if I can pit him, I am going to take my chance. This is actually the chance, I'm pretty sure, on this highway. If I can get enough speed, I will pit him. But he's actually going, he's like, oh my god. He's going to end up hitting me and I'm going to end up going flying. Yep, he's crashed, he's crashed. Barricade him, barricade him, barricade him. Put your hands up, put your hands up. I'm going to be chasing the person in the brown hair. We got somebody with a hat going down towards gas and go. Put your hands up. Put your hands up. Drop the knife. Taser, taser, taser. All right, can we get some cuffs? Can we get some cuffs over here? Can we get some? Uh, I'll do it. They just ran. More, more importantly, though, they got to catch the other people. Sir, you're under arrest. Indefinitely. All right, I'll be back to search you. We have got... Actually, I'll take my car. I don't know where they are. They must still be in a foot pursuit. All right, to avoid further accidents, we're going to set up a little rally point over here. Um, the, tech, the detective said we're going to um, hand them over to the sheriffs. We don't want any more accidents happening. The Tesla's totaled already, so that's good. Wait till I get out. I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear it. All right, I'm going to get him out because he has... I haven't searched him yet. He could probably have something on him. I know he has a knife, but I think the knife is on the ground over there. All right, sir, I'm going to ask you right now. Do you have anything on you that can hurt, stab, or poke me? Be honest with me. Let me know where those items are, please. A hammer. Okay, where's that hammer located? Let's see what he's got on him. He's probably lying. You have some shells in your pocket as well, you should have told me, uh, for a weapon that you don't have. That's awesome that you didn't have a weapon. Uh, you guys decided to go unarmed, and I pulled out my taser like a dummy, but hey. We all make mistakes. All right, you're going to be staying in my vehicle until prisoner transport gets here. Um, so have a fun time in the stinky back of my car where many, many criminals have been stored. Could be used as a patrol car. It cannot. We got a Glock 17 in here. Looks like they weren't fast enough to grab the weapons. Hey, detective, I don't mind to interrupt your business. Uh, how did we get all three suspects in custody? All right. Sounds good. Um, I'm going to rally up all the LCSO units. Do you need anything from us? You need any, uh, thing? We are counting on you guys to get this Cybertruck since you guys were the one who introduced it. Um, I don't know anything about that thing. Could you get some units down to the parking garage to search the van they came in? Yeah, I can do that. Okay. All right. Yeah, I can do that. We have too many units over here anyway. All right. Attention, LCSO. Rally up on, on me. Rally up. We're waiting for another sheriff. Is he searching? Here, guys, come over here. He's probably searching, so it's best to come over here. All right, um, who has who has a current suspect inside of their vehicle? All right, um, so you two and me. Okay, you two. You guys are going to go, you and you. I want you guys to head down to the parking garage. I need you guys to go search the vehicle that the um, criminals came in. Uh, it's a black van. I believe it's located inside the parking garage, first level. I need you guys to go search it and get the info back to the detectives, okay? If you guys need me, you can call me. Um, I'll be here. Uh, me and the rest of the guys are going to go transport our suspects, okay? The only thing you're going to hurt is yourself, buddy. You're not getting out of here. I'm just going to let you know that right now. I'm going to get my guys on you. Okay, best believe that. I'll, I'll remember that, okay? You're just probably mad you got used, you got bait car. Like, we used a bait car on you. You're just mad you got a bait car used on you. Yep, just loan them off in there. Um, there's some paper here we could just sign, and then uh, we should be on our way. Uh, the correctional guards will 
be here any second now. I think they're just grabbing something or something. I don't know. Usually there's a guard here, but I guess they're not here today. We'll get back to my shift, and now I could finally patrol. I think they're going to use another bait car, but I don't think it's going to be a Cybertruck, so good luck to them.